let me tell you something that happened to me in my early teens or in my early 20s. Not my early teens, but in my teens or in my 20s. I forget which. Anyways, before I turned 18, my mom would force me to go to church so often. And it really made no sense back then, at least to me, why I had to go to church so often. It made no sense. So, at that time period, I wanted to sin just like everyone else. Because somehow people would correlate sinning as the major way of having fun. Like, you are not having fun unless you are sinning. So, that pushed me to want to sin as well. Because, hey, as a kid, you want to sin. I mean, you want to have fun. So, if people are saying that you can have fun by sinning, the first thing that you want to do is sin. So, it got to the point where it made me think, is there really a God? Like, I was saying within myself, how do we actually know that there is a God? I was saying that within myself. And I forget the time period afterward, I had this dream and I believe I was telling you all that dreams aren't dreams. Dreams are supernatural experiences. They are not just regular dreams as some people say. So in this dream, my consciousness was the way it is now. As if I was on earth. But in this dream, supernatural experience, I could sense that I was going to hell that instant. And I was feeling terror. I was so afraid. And I started to scream. I was saying, I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe. And I was saying sorry to God. I believe I was crying. I forget. After that, I woke up. <laughs> I don't know if I was in my early 20s or my teens. I forget. What is your point, Kevin? Okay. If you are in doubt of God now, what you can do is ask God to confirm himself to you. Ask God if he really is real. Ask God to show you a sign or something that he truly exists. This is what you can do because back then when I was asking if there is really a God, I was in sin. I was not right with God, I don't think. No, I wasn't. Because if I was right with God, why would I ask if God is really real? So ask God to confirm himself to you. And I am sure that he is going to do something. It may not be what you expect, but he is going to do something. So keep this in mind. Try it. Because if you believe that there isn't a God, what is the worst that can happen, right? Try it out. Okay.
God bless you.